show this magnolia tree, which you can see above me and behind me uh, had a very large wasp nest on it, which uh, we will insert a picture of so that you can see it. We decided that it would be a good idea to get rid of it because the dog could get stung because unlike me you could just walk around and avoid it the dog doesn't think and he eventually get, would get stung so I tried to figure out how to get rid of it I didn't want to use chemistry because we have a small organic garden so I looked up and I found that you can actually freeze them in a freezer and because of the way they were situated, I was able to wait until early in the morning, it didn't work at night, and put a bag over them, zip tie the bag shut, take the bag to the freezer, and stick them in the freezer. Now, meanwhile, this is about a week ago, the wasps have now started to rebuild a new nest in the ladder that I used to climb up to cut down the old nest. So now I am going to have to figure out how to get rid of that, which is not going to work so well with my bag method. So I may have to try vacuuming them up, which will be another video at another time. We'll see. So uh, don't do that because they're going to, if they go after you, you're screwed. Okay, so now we're going to go to the freezer, if we can avoid getting stung, and see how the frozen nest came out. Okay, so this is the freezer. We use this uh, to freeze produce uh, that we sell. So we definitely need this bag of wasp nest wasps out of here uh, because we need the space. So we're going to take it out and hopefully they're all quite dead, otherwise we're going to get quite stung. So this is it. And as you can see, one bag. One. Okay, so this is actually two bags, uh, zip tied shut. You can see this is the uh, branch that they built their nest on. So I have no idea what it's going to look like. I Scissors. Oh, that nope, doesn't sound like there's any buzzing, so hopefully there isn't. And so now we'll try cutting off the zip tie if I can get at the zip tie. Oh, a wasp. Uh, I don't think that came from in here. Uh, ah, there we go. Solomon. Go on. Go on, Solomon. No, you can't sit next to me in case these guys are alive. Okay, so one zip tie. Got a hold of the branch. Hopefully this thing came out in one piece. Uh, it went in in one piece and then it went straight to the freezer, so uh, you know, I can feel that it's still cold. Yeah, here. So take a look. You can see frozen wasps. They're frozen wasp nest. And so let's see if we can get it out in one piece. So you can see the magnolia branch that they built it around. It was just like this. And so I just came up over it with the uh, bags. There's actually double bags. And you can see the uh, miscellaneous wasps. I'm sure that you can also see the, the wasp entrance, which is right here. I don't know whether you can see any wasps in there. Uh, but I assume that as the bag came over and I walked them to the freezer, this is them coming out trying to figure out what the hell is going on. And so that's it. And since I don't hear anything or see anything, hopefully they're now all dead. 
and now I only have to figure out how to get the ones that survived and built a nest in my ladder dead too. <laughs>